Oh, Lord, y'all. I was supposed to that lift. But I keep forgetting. It's so much information. I just keep forgetting. And then it's like, once I get done with the video, then I'll remember. But um, there's a book. It's called um, Les Berbes Amériques. It's French. Just type in, like, the Berbers in America. But then, like, it's French. And um, it talks about indigenous tribes in America that had Berber names and Berber customs. And um, even like some of the old um, journals, um, colonizer journals, they talk about how the um, customs of the people remind them of the Moors. And um, they even tell you like how some of the people look like people from the Canary Islands. Christopher Columbus said that. The Canary Islands, that's the Guanches, the Moors. They um, talk about how some of the people look like um, North African, um, Spaniards, Portuguese, French. These are Moors you're talking about. They ruled these areas for almost a thousand years. These are Moors. You know, the Spanish, French, um, all of them, Portuguese, you're dealing with Africans. They're African, whether they like it or not, they're African. So, um, you know, just put two and two together. Obviously, um, you know, this isn't a bashing video, but when you look at the um, natives that have the more obvious Asiatic phenotypes, you will not mistake these people for a French man, a Spaniard, a Portuguese, a North African. They don't look, they don't blend in with those populations. You know it. You know it. So these aren't the people that they were encountering at first. They encounter those people later. The people that they were encountering at first looked like North Africans. And they also mentioned that um, when they met the Arawak, they mentioned that the Arawak resembled Ethiopians. Now, you also can research the ties between the Moors and the Ethiopians as well, because there's a connection there too. But they look like Ethiopians. And like I said, those populations of people that you see today don't look nowhere near no. Y'all know they don't look Ethiopian. <laughs> That you know they don't look Ethiopian, okay? You know they don't look like you were not mistaken them for a Spaniard, a Portuguese, a North African person. You wouldn't, okay? You would not. Shoot, even some of them, um, they said look um, more like Negroid, uh, like West African, Sub-Saharan. That's another story. But I just wanted to um, point that out too, that they were making comparisons. There's books out there. And the um the Berbers in America, that's an ancient book. That's a um centuries old book. And it was written originally in French. You can't find an English um translation, so you have to use Google Translate, like copy and paste it into Google Translate and read it like that. But it's interesting um how they were finding indigenous tribes here with Berber names. So